What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Frank Warren. Frank Warren says that he fancies Zhang against Usyk, and Usyk struggles with shots to the body. And he said this quote. He says, I fancy him against Usyk, Warren said, and he said, I think he's a big, big man. I fancy him. Look, Usyk is a very, very good fighter but I fancy Daniel Dubois would give him a tough fight and he exposed him. He showed what we all know in the business because we know something about the business. We're very good at guiding fighters and I know that he struggles with shots to the body and that was shown. I've seen that in the past. He certainly won't take the punch from this guy. Those are the words of Frank Warren and Let Me Counterpunch. I think Zili Zhang fighting Usyk would be a very challenging fight for both fighters. Why? Because Usyk gives you so much movement that you won't be able to hit him like you think. But Zhang is a big guy. He is a big guy. He can punch. You've seen what he did with the juggernaut. And he goes to the body. The only thing is... Zhang is also a southpaw. So the question is, how good does Zhang do with southpaws? And how good does Usyk do with southpaws? So I think if anything, and we all knew Alexander Usyk is weak to the stomach. That's his kryptonite. That's the uppercut to Daniel Dubois, the temple shot for Anthony Joshua. You know, those are his disadvantages, right? And I think of anything, I think if Usyk fought Zhang, which that fight is could happen. If if Usyk beats Philip Hergovic, that's the next fight. Now, thinking of Frank Warren for a minute, I think Frank is just looking and hoping for the next guy to take out Usyk because Usyk is a problem. Usyk's been a problem ever since he reached and made it to the heavyweight division. And a lot of people thought that he wasn't going to get this far. A lot of people thought that he was just too small based on the heavyweights that we have today. And Zhang is one of them. And what I say about Usyk, he's tough in the chin, but that's that, that body, you know, it did expose him a bit. So we never really knew how Usyk could recover from that shot. And I think that shot was borderline. Any other referee probably would have deemed that a legal punch. But we never really knew how Usyk would have took it because that shot did cripple him, right? It crippled him to the body. He went down and he went down for a very long time. Even though the referee gave him time, he went with that time. Normally when you get hit, even with a low blow, I mean a legitimate low blow, you don't take that full five minutes. And it was, in his case, three minutes and 45 seconds. So knowing Usyk, he has a challenge. But I have to take my hat off to Usyk because he's doing what a champion's supposed to do. You fight your mandatories to prove that you are the reigning and defending unified champion of the world or champion of the world. Okay, so... I think this is the next fighter for Frank to hopefully upset Usyk because Usyk is a problem because we all know Usyk is that guy that could possibly be one of the best. In the, he's already the best in the world, but it's that underlining argument with Tyson Fury. Since Tyson Fury wouldn't fight him, there's really no true explanation on why Tyson didn't want to fight Usyk. He don't really have any. And if anything... If Usyk's out of the way, then that argument, then that 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 black shade, that black storm over Tyson Fury will be eradicated. Because, you know, everyone knew Tyson ducked him. Tyson ducked him two or three times. And it just shows you why did he duck such a middleweight or a smaller fighter? Because he would have to deal with a lot of movement. I'll do another video about that, but... I think Zhang is coming to fight. 
And Frank did a smart job by signing Zhang. You know, Zhang was with Hearn before. Now Frank got him, and he's hoping that maybe Zhang can be that guy to knock out Usyk. And then guess what? Advantage Frank. Why? Because then he would have the unified champion, Zili Zhang, if he upsets Usyk, and he has Tyson Fury. So he has all the belts. He has all the champions in his promotional banner. So I can see why the appeal for Zili Zhang or the desire for Zili Zhang to beat Alexander Usyk, I can see that because he has all, he would then have all the fighters. So that's Frank Warren's uh, counterpunch. You guys tell me what you think about Zili Zhang beating possibly Alexander Usyk, according to Frank Warren. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunch. Peace.